Hello guys, welcome to today's Wet Wednesday Coffee Break. So on today's show we're going to be talking about um, plant diseases, obviously, and we're answering the question, what is wrong with my plant? And we're going to take you through a step-by-step -step process as to when you see a plant that you feel is diseased, what should be your first action? So stay tuned. And Oh no, my beautiful Indian hawthorn is diseased. I wonder if there's a lab that can help diagnose my beautiful plants. You should try the Texas Plant Disease Diagnostic Lab. The first step will be to go to our website, which is plantclinic.tamu.edu. You can also find it by just Googling Texas Plant Disease Diagnostic Lab and it should be the first result. Um, once you're at the website, there are our forms on the side of each tab under forms and instructions, and you just find the form that suits your situation and make sure to fill it out. Um, there is also a services tab that lists all of the services we offer, so you can see if the lab can, e can even help you uh, in the first place. We have a bunch of great tabs with a ton of useful information, so most of the questions that you will probably have can be found on our website. Um, we also have a fees tab that you can look at if you have questions about submitting payments. And um, there is also a ton of instructions on the second page of the form. So if you're wondering how much of the sample or what part of the sample you need to submit, you can just go to the second page of our form and it'll tell you for what situation uh, you're submitting a sample, what all we need. So please make sure to fill out the whole form because we use all of the information and send it with your sample. If for some reason you don't know all the information and you are not able to fill the form out in its entirety, don't sweat it. It's okay to have some blanks on the form. If you want to send in any additional comments, you're more than welcome to. You can just put them on a separate sheet of paper and send in with the form. And also if you have pictures, um, that can help out uh, greatly to see the whole picture of the where the plant is at and um, see more of the symptoms that you're seeing. So next time you encounter one of your plants and you see that it could be diseased, remember, instead of just shooting us an email and asking what's wrong with it, send us the actual sample because it is so much easier to diagnose it correctly when we have something tangible. Thanks for joining us on this Wet Wednesday Coffee Break. And have a good one. When your plant's disease, be at ease. Don't get mad, send it to the lab.